Kristen Alexis and today is August the 6th it's Sunday afternoon probably about like 12 or 1 o'clock yeah 12 15 so Brian actually is outside doing some yard work I'm about to finish up editing a YouTube video but I decided today we're vlogging B Jones is off of work I'm off work we got Aries in the background eating breakfast so it's a pretty good day to vlog so that's what we're gonna do so I hope you guys are all doing great and if you are new to our channel thank you so much for tuning in but with that let's have an amazing day channel we actually did a vlog a few weeks ago where I was talking about Kroger and Walmart and all that good stuff and today I've been pretty busy I've actually done like two or three videos and ended up not really doing much with Ryan yet so we haven't done much vlogging but we were about to and <laughs> he's about to leave me crazy. Uh-oh. Okay, so Brian is grilling. There's the grill back there. <laughs> He's basically cooking like chicken and brats and hamburgers, just a few random things. But one thing I wanted to update you guys on, so we moved in and we did a video talking about our move-in, our new house, and it was basically an empty house tour. But since the empty house tour, we have done so many things to the house. So we're probably gonna be doing a furnished house tour to show you guys all of the updates that we've done to our home, which I'm super excited about. There's just been so many little things that I think make the home really comfortable and so enjoyable. Like for example, up here Brian actually wait let me just show you guys here <laughs> I'm trying to point right at it but no Brian actually added some sound outside so we had sound that was actually wired through the whole house now we can actually listen to the sound and hook up our phones to it and it's such a nice touch I, if you guys love music as much as me it is just so much fun oh mosquitoes are gonna get me you guys I didn't realize the mosquitoes are so bad oh my gosh <laughs> but no it's such a nice touch like oh my goodness and then the hue lights we've actually added the hue lights all throughout the house so now we don't just have them in the room that I do my YouTube our bedroom the living room and then we just finished the kitchen so I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek and show you guys look at how pretty that is I just love the hue lights like once you get the hue you're gonna be addicted and it's such an expensive habit because as you add the bulbs throughout your house they're so expensive but it's such a nice touch like I love it and if you're doing an event or a party or having company over it just really adds a touch that I just can't imagine anything else doing so yeah but let's go find Brian see what he's up to he's been hiding from me I've been like chasing this man all around the house <laughs> I feel like I've been blogging this whole vlog, so we gotta get Brian involved. You know, Trump, Trump, Trump. 
in a champion sound. In a ch- they, they want to talk to you. Champion mm-hmm. sound. In a champion sound. In a champion sound. In a champion sound. I did a video on my channel like a while back talking about like divorce and my whole divorce story and a lot of people ask me about prenups and how do I feel about it and I'm curious like how do you feel about it? Yeah, I, don't, I don't like prenups. It's like setting yourself up for failure. It's like all right, I'm putting this in place because I know one day there's a chance that I'm probably going to want to leave you. Like, I don't think it's that. I think it's saying that the, what else is that, the, saying? that the relationship is not set on money. Why do you have to worry about that if you're going to be together for the rest of your life? Like you don't, that's I don't think it's about issue. worrying about that, but I think it's about the fact that... A prenup is in place for if you separate, not if if you're together. A prenup's not for, hey, we're together, I bring in 100000 to this relationship, you bring in 50000 we're going to put X amount, I'm going to have this. A prenup is for when you break up. It's not but for like, together, it's for when you break up. So you're already planning on breaking up. You're already thinking 12 years down the road, like, hey, if I don't like this person, when I'm ready to break up, I want to make sure. But I don't think it's that, because I think, like, you can you can set the the details of a prenup. So you can set, say, like. So you're setting the details of your breakup. That's exactly what you But you can say, like, the person who feels like they're most liable can say, if I leave, then you get everything. But if you do, then you don't. Set yourself up for failure because a lot of times people will stay in a situation because of that pretty much like, hey, I agreed if I leave, I have to pay out X amount of dollars, so I'm staying with the end of my life and catch it up. I don't believe in prenups. But I think for me, it's like challenging because I went through divorce before. When I went into my marriage, it wasn't like that. Like, when I went into my marriage, we loved each other and I thought I was going to do something for the rest of my life. And he left me and then ended up coming after me. So it kind of makes me like nervous about getting into another situation without something saying that we come in and if we come in, we leave with what we came with. What do you guys think? This is like such an interesting conversation. at the wedding, like your money's my money, we're just getting married, but your money's my money, or your money's your money, my money's my money. We're gonna agree to pay these bills and that's it. But marriage is a contract. I mean, if you look at it from like a, you know, it's basically a contract. I feel like this life is like horrible for a vlog, but I, I'm enjoying Pretty them right now. <laughs> I don't know, what do you guys think? Comment below, what are your thoughts on a prenup? Is a prenup a bad thing? Is it a good thing? I mean, I think we have our positions on what we think about it. But I'd love to hear you guys' thoughts, so comment below. Oh my gosh, guys, look at all this stuff. This is like not healthy. I was trying to like not eat processed foods. Oh shoot, I just touched it. No, but I was trying not to eat processed, but this bratwurst looks so good. Chicken wings. We got corn on the cob in here. And then we got macaroni and cheese. This is two starches, I know. Don't even say nothing, but it's still about to be fired. I'm closing out the vlog again, cause you know how I do, I always have to steal the camera when Kristen's not around, cause she won't let me have the camera. Comment below, prenup or no. I'm like team no on the prenup. She's like team yes, so I'm like, who wants to do that? Once again, she's just saying, hey, I know we mean this, but later on down the road, when we think about breaking up, I know I'm covered, it's gonna make it easier to yada yada yada. Like, no, it's already in your mind, but <sighs> to each their own, right? But not really, because two become one, and you have to be aligned, and you have to be joined together, so it's not to each his own at that point. It's You have to be on the same mind page, and so, hence, that's why you want the prenup, because then you're not on the same page. All right, but on that note, your boy B. Jones, I'm out of here. Thank you all for tuning in. I'm out. Peace. I'm tired. About to go watch TV. Don't know what I'm gonna watch. Kristen's probably already asleep. Ask her about the corn. How was the corn on the grill? Okay, real.
real quick before the vlog is really closed out. Brian really thinks he can close the vlog without me. You know closing the vlog without me. <laughs> no, but in all seriousness, I feel like this is a very serious topic and there's so many perspectives on what the real best answer is to do and I don't know if there really is a best answer. So, as we said before, comment below. This is a very, very good conversation starter. Very good conversation in general. So comment and let us know what you think. Like, is a prenup a bad idea? Is it jinxing your relationship? Is it a good idea? You just come in with, the, with what you come in and you leave with what you came in the event that things just don't work out. So, I don't know. I'm in the middle. I'm not like on the left or the right. On this conversation I feel like it could go either way with me but I want to hear what you guys think so comment below and with that I love you guys I appreciate you thank you so much for watching this whole video and with that we will see you next time all right bye bye <laughs>